My name is Gabrielle Cantor. I'm a junior here at IU and I'm majoring in Intelligent Systems Engineering. I'm here at IU at uh, ISE doing a PhD in Intelligent Systems Engineering. I came to IU first to study neuroscience uh, but switched to engineering because I wanted a major where I could apply concepts as I was learning them. I wanted to learn the tools and the methods that people actually use in the workforce. Intelligent systems engineering is AI first engineering because the intelligent systems are what you're building so actually everybody should be building intelligent systems for almost every engineering task there is. This is bleeding edge technology that will change the way the human beings uh, interact with the environment. The program at Bloomington is unique in that it is focusing on a modern vision of engineering which is built into many programs such as Industry 4.0, which is a big international program. But we have a, our program is built from scratch. We don't have to convert our program to adopt modern technology. We are modern because we just started in adopting the very principles that are driving the next approach to engineering. The students begin designing day one. And so uh, from, from Engineering 101, literally, there's a design project and, and we uh, bolster the students with, um, with the underpinnings that they need to be able to essentially um, create a prototype project by the end of the semester. And while there's some guidance in the early parts of the, of the uh, labs, um, some, some tasks and some fabrications that are uh, designed in a particular way to give the students the skills that they need, in the end, by the end of the first semester, they are uh, designing something that they've completely uh, created in a, in a small team. One of the most interesting classes I had this year was our engineering digital systems class. And so in that class, we were looking at how we can build digital systems and how we can build small sensors um, and then connect them to networks and kind of build a system. And so we partnered with Hoosier National Forest to build out a uh, light monitoring system. So they're trying to get a, it's called a dark sky designation to see how dark the sky is in the forest. So that was a really cool class to kind of work on a real world problem that's actually going to be implemented. And actually building a circuit board was a really cool experience. The most interesting class this year was simulating cancer as an intelligent system. I learned a lot of skills in literature searching and cell modeling software. I was taking it at the same time as molecular biology, so I would learn how the pathways should work in cells and then go to this cancer class and learn how they fail. What we really want is tenacious, resilient problem solvers. We want students who are going to be able to stick with the problem and be cutting edge in their thinking, but also be willing to put in the work and solve that problem. We have courses on cloud computing, big data computing, streaming, um, as well as on uh, Internet of Things. And my research that involves um, graduates and undergraduates is, is uh, focused on basically doing intelligent data reduction at the edge. We create applications, accelerating them uh, using programmable logic. And instead of getting all those data processed in a, in a cloud computing environment, we are pushing that co computation to the edge of the network, near to the source of those data. Uh, and this is a very innovative uh, field of research. The biggest selling point of this major is that it's somewhere where you're going to be challenged to build hands-on real-world solutions every day. What we're trying to do is produce graduates who are useful in high-demand fields on day one. From day one, I mean, we're building with our hands. We're actually building out projects to see if they work. We're testing with real people. We're trying to see what we can do and how we can best make a difference in the world. And I think if you want to be a part of a program that's trying to push the envelope and is trying to give you the skills that you're going to need in the future to really make a difference, then this is the place to be.